Hey everybody, welcome back to another video showcasing some of the new features we have in our firmware 2.9 update. An update I was pretty excited about. Today we're going to take a look at one of the new cabs that are included with firmware 2.9 and that is the cab that goes along with the Fullerton amp models that were introduced in 2.8. The Fullerton is a model of a 1958 Fender 5C3 Tweed Deluxe. I'm reading that because I wanted to make sure I got it right. So a 1958 Fender 5C3 Deluxe. The only problem is in 2.8, they had the amp model ready, but they did not have the associated stock speaker cab to go along with it. Much like the Grammatico uh, Lagrange amp, uh, same sort of thing, right? So what I thought would be kind of neat is to compare what used to come up stock with the uh, Fullerton amp, which was the 112 US Deluxe cab that was paired up with it, and compare that to how it sounds compared to the new Fullerton cab that kind of goes with that amp and see what the difference was. I mean, there's no right and wrong here, right? Uh, some of these things might be, you know, better in some situations and in some in others, right? So let's go over to HXZ and take a look. So a while back, quite some time ago, or actually right after 2.8 came out, I did a video, a dialing in video, creating a tone for the Fullerton Bright Amp. And this is it. And I stuck with the 112 US Deluxe and, uh, speaker cab as the cab that I wanted to go with it. I was pretty happy with how that work turned out. Um, so what I've done is I've set up two snapshots. I set up one snapshot with the US Deluxe cab right here with the 160 ribbon mic three and a half inches back which is what I chose as far as settings back then. And then I set up another snapshot so that that one shuts off and I replace it with the 112 Fullerton, same mic, same distance back, 160 ribbon, three and a half inches back. That's gonna be important because we wanna hear the difference between the cab and not the microphone we have on it or the distance of the microphone, okay? So let's take a listen. Here is the original tone that I had. Uh, dialed in. I can't remember what guitar I used on this and I can't remember what performance video I did, but anyways, it, this is how it sounded. All right, let's listen to what the new Fullerton cab sounds like with all the identical settings. Back to the US Deluxe. Fullerton cap. US Deluxe. Fullerton. Go to the neck pickup. Back to the US Deluxe cab. Middle position. And back to the Fullerton cabs. Middle 
position. Back to the bridge. So again, deluxe. Fullerton. Deluxe. A little more bottom end beef on the deluxe cab and the Fullerton's a little bit thinner down there, I find. Regardless, either way, very nice stuff. I'm pretty happy with those, both of those, but I'm really liking the new Fullerton and Grammatical cabs. I think the folks at Line 6 did an excellent job capturing some really great speakers here, and I think that's going to be a really nice tool to have in our tool kit uh, going forward with, uh, with dialing in tones with these amps and even others. You know, mixing and matching is always fun. So that was just a fun little video to show you guys a little about how that the, the, uh, the new cab sounds in comparison to what would have been paired up before and just give you a little bit of an insight into how it sounds. Hope you guys enjoyed. Please like the video, share it if you don't mind, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and hit the little notification bell so you get notified when I put new videos out. And uh, thank you guys so much again for tuning in. I really appreciate it and I uh, really appreciate you giving me your time. And I'll be back soon with some more content. As for now, hope everybody's doing well and ciao for now.